then I understand the, the, the sound bite is ready. Let's take a listen to Abiola Akiode. That's the president of Transition Monetary Group. Then we'll come back. We're concerned about the uh, way and manner the deployment will go tomorrow. We do hope that it will be scientific enough to be able to reach you know, as many places as possible because if we have 30, 31,000 uh, police officers, that's quite huge. Often time, we hear the numbers, but in terms of impact, uh, they are not always uh, felt. Um, so by and large, we do hope that um, the election tomorrow will be free and fair. However, we are calling for the establishment of mobile courts on election day to uh, summarily uh, prosecute election of offenders. It might not come to fruition in this election, but we do hope that such can uh, be uh, a way of addressing the violence that we keep seeing in election. In other countries where they have had mobile court on election day, it has helped in terms of stemming violence. Because if a kingpin is arrested, you know, on election day, might also deter the others who might want to do uh, the same. Now that they've decided to place three policemen in one police unit, I think that will, you know, help a long way to, you know, reassuring the citizenry that uh, they, are, they won't be defranchised. And I also believe their presence will do a whole lot good. Through the intervention of the Omonobane do Kwa Kolo Kolo, Ewai no Gidigan, as, you know, with uh, his, his intervention, you know, everybody, they've come down. They've laid down their arms because we do not go against our Oba. We respect our Oba because is a representative of God here on earth. So the Beninese have respect for him. I believe the election will be peaceful. We believe that the citizens are safe as far as security is concerned. And uh, also our vote will be counted on that day of election. So we are assuring the citizens that they should not be scared Police are on ground, as they assured us, so we will be available. The citizens should watch out, the head of security agencies, the army, the police, the civil defense, the air force, the immigration, and so on and so forth, should, work, should watch out for those who may try to impersonate them. By wearing their uniform, but even uh, they are, they are vehicles, because we have seen it in the past. We should watch us so that we can able to fish out those who may like to cause violence in the state.